This is Anna with Anna D. Scratch and Crafts. Today I've got two of the $20 Half a Million Crosswords. Now for those of you who have not seen this card before, because don't play it that often, we have three large puzzles. One, two, three. And we have one, two, three, four bonus puzzles. One and two play together. If we get three words on either card or a combination of three words on both cards, here is the plane or payout table. On the bonus, if we get the word, we win the prize that's underneath it. On the third puzzle, it's this play out for it. So being such a large card, I either keep moving it back and forth, back and forth to make us all dizzy, or what I'm going to do is I'm going to scratch the numbers off and play the third puzzle, and since you can see it, the bottom two bonuses. And then I will move the card up and put the letters over on the side here and you can see me play the other puzzles. So I'm going to set up and get ready to play. Ticket number three, first two letters are D and P. D, P, nope, but we do have a D here, <clears throat> and a P in input, F and K, F and K, nope, H and Q, here's an H, no Q, H and Q, Nope. E and X. Nope. I and L. Finally got a vowel. So we got I and L. I and vanity. L and almost. Next two, got a W and a J, nope, and no. S and Z, got two S's in fossil, but no Z, got an S and almost. Two more, U-M, so we got hum, it's our first word. U and M, we got an M. U and dual and TY. So TY and vanity. We got a T and almost. And a T. And the last two letters are R and B. R. I missed an H here. R and B. Missed an L. Okay, we've got an S that I missed, so we have fresh and we have hum. No A, no G, no O, no A, C, or E. So just the two, which I needed three, and neither of those bonuses work. So at this point now, we move it up, and the letters should now be appearing on the side here. And we'll kind of do the Rachel method. So I've got an L, E, but no A. Volley, no O, so no bonus words. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, appliance, no A. Graduate, no A. Electric, E, L, E. But no C. Pirate, no A. Speak, no A. Sketch, S K E T, but no C. Turn, T U R, no N. Double check, but nope, no N. Wedding, no N. Coming down, angel, no A N. Ledge, L E D 
L, E, D, no G. Notice no N, taxi, T, A, no A. What else coming down? Lot, L, O, T, no O. Sick, S, I, no C, Ant, A, N, no N, Pit, P, I, well, found one word, Pit. Skin, S, K, but no N, End, no N, Rack, R, A, no A. And it looks like there is no other there, so just the one. So up to the top. Diamond, no N, each, no C. Status, no A. Landmark, no A. Vegetable, no A. Look, no O. Around, no O. East, no A. Coming down, act, no A, no C. Oat, no O, oh, no A. Describe, no C. Shovel, no O. And, no N. Math, no A. Value, no A. Gloss, no G. Try, T-R-Y, that we do have. Even, E-V, no N. So only one word there, one word here, never found the three. Yeah, you can see it. The letters FW, and V. That tells me the first one is not a winner. So we'll go on to the second one, which is card number 004, and see if we can find a winner here. First two letters. O and Q. We got an O and we've got an O. O and Q. O and O. No Q. XP. X and P. Got a P. Next two. Z and U. Do have a U. Z and U. We have two Z's in nozzle. Nope, no U. B and L. Nope, do have an L. L, L. No B. W and C. Got a W and Tweed. And no C. F and M. Got an M. Got two F's. F and M. Nope. V and J. No V, no J. Got a V in live. But no J. Have an I and an H. I in live. And that's the only one. E.G. E's always a good one. Two E's in toffee. E, 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 E. E and G gives me leg. So we have Y and R. I was looking for a T. Y and R. I had a question asked for me from one of my viewers who is new to lottery cards and what he was asking was where do I turn in the cards. It's a little different in every state, it's a little different in every country, but it's pretty much kind of the same in all of those. For the smaller amounts, you turn them back into the retailer that you bought it from or another retailer who does sell the cards. In Colorado, 
if I can find it somewhere in here, all retailers will pay up to $150 from their stores. Now, some of the smaller ones, like convenience stores and whatever, they will pay no more than the $150. They just simply don't have the cash on hand. It goes into their safes and keeps their employees safe. The larger places, like grocery stores and whatever, they have the ability to pay a little bit more. So they can pay up to $599 on this particular card. Anything higher than $599, which we call claimers, will have to be turned into the lotto headquarters. Here it gives the P.O. box number and where you can mail it, or it tells you you can take it to one of their sites that you'd have to look up to where they're at. But like that, pretty much standard in all states, and like I said, from what I've read on the back of foreign country cards, pretty much the same thing. They'll tell you where you can take it, what are the amounts limited that they will pay at the retailers and what you'll have to go to a main headquarters to be paid for the larger amounts. So I hope that answers the questions for some of you who have never done these before. So, enjoyed giving you this information. If you wanted to skip through it, understood that. I like bringing you this video. If you enjoyed it, please give me that thumbs up. It helps me. Also, subscribe and hit that notification bell if you subscribe so you know when the next one's coming out. And wherever you're at, have a good day or good night, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! And if you enjoyed my video, please press the like button, hit the subscribe button if you haven't, and the notification bell so you know when my next video is out. Thank you!